Has Yellowstone received its final crushing blow? Is it D-Day for the record-breaking series? It's curtains for Costner. The actor set the ball rolling by slamming the door shut on being recast. And now, Beth Dutton is also hanging up her boots. The epic action-packed show that sent viewership ripping through the roof has hit a major snag. Heavy-duty family drama is unfolding at the ranch. Is this the final curtain call? Call us dramatic, but Destiny is playing a cruel trick on the most watched show ever by striking away its most iconic characters. First it was John Dutton, and now it's Beth Dutton who has bitten the dust. Is the cast poised to undergo some kind of massive overhaul? That's a topic for another day. For now, it's time to mourn the loss of the sauciest, most spicy cast member of the hit series. The quintessential black sheep, the rebellious wild child. She will leave a huge hole in the Dutton clan. Apart from the fact that the entire planet has a permanent soft spot for the eternally misunderstood misfit, Beth Dutton brought that oomph, that wild streak with her off-the-cuff witty banter and an intelligence that would rock some IQ test scores. Definitely not your average baddie, she's cruel to the core. Beth's dark and tormented inner world makes her an utter queen, but enough about that. Back to the tragedy that's all set to befall the show. The sass and jazz of Beth Dutton is truly lit and it wouldn't have ever lit up her screens had it not been for the original boss lady herself, Kelly Riley. Riley truly blossomed as the badass Beth Dutton. Maybe it was a mutual love for horses between the two that factored into the equation to make her on-screen avatar a force to be reckoned with. Just in case you've been hiding under a rock disconnected from the real world, Yellowstone is all set to wrap up after the latter half of its fifth season. Has Riley really thrown in the towel? Yes, let that sink in. There aren't any two ways about it. Even though Riley has really gotten into the skin of her character, it seems as if she's headed up to here with taking on the role of yet another baddie. For her, it's more a case of been there, done that, and having none of it no more. However, Riley is one smart cookie. It seems to be a more head-over-heart decision, a strategic move to catapult her soaring career to even greater heights. She's all about putting her acting medal to the test and skidding off to explore acting gigs that plunge her acting talents into uncharted territory. The boss babe is all about taking charge of her acting career. She'd rather take on the role of a first-rate Beth Dutton rather than of a second-rate Beth Dutton wannabe. Whoa, that's deep. We're all for it, but really, what about the legacy of Yellowstone? While we're on the subject, let's dig a little deeper into it, shall we? It's time to explore all the possibilities. Looks like the very last that we will see of the fun and fiery Beth Dutton is in the second half of Season 5. After that, it's time to wave sayonara. Does the fate of the other cast members hang in the balance? Or do they plan on hanging in there? Word on the street is that Casey Dutton, Luke Grimes, would rather stick to his musical career than hang around to shoot another spin-off. Well, you can't blame a man for listening to his inner calling. Another man on the go with musical aspirations is Ryan Bingham. He plans to plonk a new album for his audience's listening pleasure. There's just too much musical talent going around, if you ask us, but it is what it is. Time to get to grips with reality. And then Kevin Costner's infamous exit is the talk of the town. Kevin has got his eyes set on newer horizons with his own western endeavor. The guy is a unit. Ironically, his new flick will be titled Horizon. Back to Beth Dutton then. There's a deeper reason why Riley isn't down with playing the role of Ms. Dutton in the future. It all boils down to the grimy gremlins hiding in the deep dark crevices of Dutton's psyche. Yep's, those inner demons and dragons again. Facts, this loyal lass's life is turning a fast corner as the show careens forward like a flaming fire engine to ignite our screens for its final season. Let us bring you up to speed on the hot mess Beth's life has become. Who's pushing Beth's buttons? Well, Beth certainly can't be a picture of serenity or the poster girl for emotional health as her life has been effed up by some pretty nasty stuff. The poor girl knows she has been duped by her father about the train station. Getting duped can really do your head in. Not only that, a major ick factor in Beth's life is stepbro Jamie. He alone is responsible for keeping a giant simmering cauldron of hate bubbling within Beth's heart. 
The feel-good factor is seriously missing here. We feel Riley. We did a quick vibe check, and this is definitely giving off questionable vibes. Getting into the skin of such a raw and powerful character is not for the faint-hearted. The amazing actor has poured her heart and soul into Beth's on-screen existence and given it all she's got. No wonder she needs a permanent break. We've almost absolved her of committing this grave error, but hey, no judgment. We were kind of pinning our hopes, though, on Beth carrying the show forward on her own shoulders. It's time to become a wet blanket and start whining again. With Costner making his final exit, John Dutton will be finally giving up the ghost. This gives us the opportunity to scroll through the list of would-be leaders at the ranch. Who do you think has the guts, the grit, and the chutzpah to pull such a tricky gig off? Who's the best contender? The biggest boss of them all. The Dutton family ranch is not exactly known for its tranquil grounds and breezy lifestyle. The place is an absolute ticking time bomb with a nearly terminal barrage of family drama and outside threats. The family has a lot going for it, including its dysfunctional dynamic. Add outside conflict and corporate greed to the mix, and we know it will take some serious brains to protect that family legacy. And that's where Beth Dutton gets the top vote to hold those reins tight, if the family holds on to the ranch. For one, she has a ton of business smarts and is not scared of putting them to good use. Her big baddie moves to scare the living daylights out of the oil magnate and taming the beast within him into doing her bidding were not lost on the viewers. Something can also be said of her experience. She's not just your average Susie making a good time of it at the ranch. The woman has grown major emotional muscles thanks to her crazy, tumultuous life. This is one lady who is cold-blooded when it comes to financial savvy. In a land where old-fashioned traditions are law, she sticks out like a sore thumb, but in a good, bad way. Her brand of intelligence is exactly what the doctor ordered to safeguard the ranch from the shysty world of under-the-table dealings and big bucks. And then, she has her eye-candy hubby, Rip, who can chip in by taking care of all the brawny stuff. Beauty and the brawn? It's a perfect combination. Of course, this outcome is not likely to materialize in the upcoming spin-off because no one can do Beth Dutton like Kelly Riley. Humble Beginnings Riley is the CEO of her own acting game as Beth Dutton. But can you even imagine that there was a time when she was struggling to get Beth? The actor dropped a candid bomb that it took her a hot minute to really get a feel for Beth's particular brand, her signature acidic persona. The transition from Kelly to Beth was more than a little tricky. Stepping into Beth's hot-blooded character was like getting inside a sports car for Kelly, or so she says. However, Kelly's meticulous streak kicked in and she revved up gears to jot down notes. Yep, all of Beth's highs and lows and nuances found their way into Kelly's notes. Well, that strategy worked out fine for her as Beth and definitely drew attention from the audience like no other character could. Come what may, being a part of Yellowstone is a journey that has certainly made Kelly proud. Ah, we're loving this happy ending at least. What's your take on Kelly Riley bidding adieu to the show? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. If you dig our content, hit that like button. Until next time.